Hello, welcome back to Virtual Mind. We are back again with the query solving video. So, one of our video query was, as you can see on the screen, they want a file where they just type a single alphabet and the value should get replaced with absent or present and they don't need a checkbox or something like that. So, let's see how we have done this. So, this can be done with two ways. One with the VBA and another one without the VBA. Okay. We are going to see both the way. So the first one is with the VBA. So here, if you are typing A and hitting the enter, see, the value is getting changed to absent. And if we type P and hit enter, it will get changed to present. And so, it has been done with the help of VBA. We have written the code over here. And the code says whenever we are typing P, it should change the value to present. And if we are typing A, then absent. And apart from A or B, if anything comes over there, then it should clear the content. So if we are typing anything like H, C, it will automatically clear the content. So the only alphabet allowed over here is A and P. The another way is the without VB. So here, without vba so here in excel you can't assign a value to a alphabet without vba so what so what you can do you can use a name manager and if you are using a name manager then always you have to type equal to so if you are typing equal to a then it will give you as absent equal to p and it will give you as present so same way equal to p present equal to equal to a as absent so over here we have used the name manager to assign the value to the particular alphabet over here we have given the name as a so whenever you are using equal to a it will refer to as absent okay so here are the both the ways so let's start with the tutorial and first we'll take the without vb we'll move on to the next step so here first we'll go to the formula tab and then click on the name manager we'll delete both this and rewrite the and now we'll create the new one you have to click on new tab then under name just give the alphabet whatever you want over here we'll be using a refer to will be typing the absent and just click ok so you can see a got the value as absent and and same way we'll be doing for the present so we'll be giving a name as p and refer to present and click ok then just close this window so now whenever you type a and just you have to hit the enter it will give you the result as absent and if you type equal to p and hit enter it will give you the result as present so this was the tutorial for the without vba now moving to the vba part so first you have to go into the developer tab click on visual basic we'll be deleting this code and we'll be rewriting it again just click on the street where you want the code to run we will be running the code on C2 over here you have to click on drop down select worksheet then you select the change now what this means whenever worksheet notice any changes it will run this code just have to delete the this part and now under the private sub we can write our code
You can either write the code as shown on the screen or you can copy the code from our blog. The blog link you can get it from the video description. So the code is simple. We are just assigning the value to alphabet and to do that we'll be using if and else condition. So now our code has been written. So let's move on to the Excel and do the testing. So if we are typing the A over here, it's getting replaced by absent. And if you type P, it will be replaced by present. So I hope this tutorial finds helpful to you. And if you like our video and if you have more queries, then do subscribe and comment our channel. Then we'll definitely make sure that the query has been resolved with the very easy tutorial thank you for watching excel mind